hand it to the lady. She knows how to throw a party. It was like this with the Ravagers, too. Yondu was a real work hard, play hard sort. Thanos doing either usually ended up with murder. We compare and scuddy father figures because mine gave me a shock collar for my birthday. Once we ditch this place, I'll show you guys a real party. Uh, I will construct festive headwear worthy of this celebration. Throne room entrance is down there, so we just gotta. You know, we our way across the chasm. Quietly. Gotta say, this is not what I had in mind when you pitched this whole hero for hiring me. Maybe Hellbender will give you a job. I'm not the one she was interested in. <laughs> She's right. We should have just sold Drax. Maybe next time we're in a bind, we can auction off a date with Drax. Katathians do not date. We perform feats of virility and are judged worthy. Or not. That how you ended up with your wife? That was the most proficient killer in the village. Your affections were sought after more than most. Sounds like my kind of woman. That's it. Dead ahead. Past another bunch of lightweights. You're sure that tracker of yours is reliable? Trust me, this baby's paid for itself. Oh, you actually paid for it? Paid, stolen, such. I trust Rocket's do, Dad. Remember that time with Ansara? <laughs> I remember no such time. Before your days, muscles. Quill got caught stealing eggs from this place on Sakaar. Why am I not surprised? My doodad led me straight to him, hiding in a spike hatchery. I was not hiding. Yes, you were. Admit it. Now the Ravagers. There's a bunch that knew at a party. Do your magic, Rocket. It is not magic. Just say it. Have a little faith, Barry. My tech built them thumpers. It's gonna pop this door, and it'll find Groot. It is shameful that Lady Hellbender's minions are so easily evaded. Am I good, or am I good? Those were the same options. Okay, Tracker says... Ah, come on, you skaggy. I knew that thing was junk. We saw him take Groot down the elevator, right? So we just gotta find the controls. Lady Ladi does probably got him on her fancy chair up there. We are down here. Hellbender used some sort of rising stairs. There's gotta be a way of activating them from ground level. Are we certain there is in fact an elevator? Of course we're sure. We saw Groot leave on it. If we can't find a switch, maybe we can get access to the circuitry itself. Maybe there's some stairs. There are several stairs. I mean stairs down to Groot. There's a perfectly good elevator. It's not perfectly good if we can't get it working. Then we better get it working. Drax, think you could lift this thing? Easily. What do you want me to do with it? Still working on that. Come on, buddy. Do something. What's wrong? Nothing. It's just, uh... Groot ain't moving or nothing. Perhaps he is asleep. Maybe there's a control panel inside there you can hack. It's possible. Of course she can't just have a normal friggin' ground-level chair. All right, Drax. Try to clear that rubble. At once. Let's see what's hiding back there. Think you could have made more noise with that? Of course. She did not ask. All right. I'm sending the schematic to your visor. Just follow the wiring and tell me which junctions to switch. Uh, here? Done. Cool! It changed, I can see it! Doesn't take much to impress you. Ah, oh, this thing is a mess. There's wires everywhere. Have you seen the Milano? Hey! Those are much more organized than they could be. Switch this. Done. Uh, 
Ugh, these ground wires are just tied together. Lucky I don't get fried. Do not die in that hole, Rodent. You'll be unable to retrieve your corpse. You're all heart, Drax. This one. Oh, here. Yep. It's half powered, but I don't got enough juice to flip the circuit yet. There's gotta be a second node. Okay. Ugh, what are they doing trying to run this much current through one capacitor? Is there a problem? Just amateurs. This whole board is gonna need to be replaced. Right now. Well, no. But I should at least leave a note. Okay, there. Keep it like that. I can get up to the throne now. Better hope that panel actually works, because I'm out of things to tinker with down here. Of course it'll work. down on the other side. Well, it's the only one we got, sweetheart. This is it. We're almost there. I gotta say, this is going pretty smooth. Kinda nice for a change. Oh, please. You'd get bored if it was all smooth sailing. Remember the cargo run for the Hanchi? I remember you nearly jumping us into a black hole. Here's my point. The exciting bits are what stick with you. What the piece of scut? Right on cue. It's not that. Something's wrong. Sp Heads up, more guards. I would give a wide berth, Peter Quill. Oh, come on, you hunk of chunk. Flark! Shh. Anyone else got a bad feeling all of a sudden? Rocket, keep it down. Stuff it, Quill. Brute's tracker just went dark. You said we're almost there. I'm sure he's fine. You sure as scut. Groot! That could have gone better. Could have gone worse. At least he didn't wake anyone on his way. Rodent has tiny padded feet. possible that Broden would leave without us after freeing the tree. No, he wouldn't. Maybe we should hurry up. Easy does it. We are not the ones wearing jet boots. Tracks. What's with this place and no railings? It's like they got the architect from the Death Star. I am not familiar with that installation. We should probably split up. Stand back. I will breach the perimeter. It's too thick. It's too thick. Who knew? That's it. Just like the Arago drop, bud. On three, two. Oh, that dashed witch stripped you down to your bark. You know, we'd have showed up sooner, but uh, we pulled the toes. Good to have you back, Root. Now all we need is an exit. Uh, I guess Groot knows the way. Hey, wait up, bud. What's going on? Say something. You okay, Groot? Shut it, Quill. What did I do? You're the one who insisted on this stupid plan. Now that freaking monster queen has... I don't know. Traumatized him. Exactly. Is that it, big guy? 
Perhaps the tree has been bewitched. She did do something to that Taratara. So no one's gonna talk about the fact that he's walking around naked. Hey, come on, talk to me, bud. What did that Badoon Flarka do to you? Look. Psst. Peter! Something's not right. What do you mean? Not sure yet. Why are you two whispering? Was the tree able to open its prison cell? I think they're more like pens, you know, like a zoo. I'm not familiar with this concept. It's a place where they keep wild animals in cages. You do not appear familiar with the concept of prison. Come on, big guy. Don't just clam up. I told you, it should have been me in that box. <clears throat> well, that's funny. Let's try that again. Fruit! Easy there, bud. I'll get you out in a flash. Whoa! Hey! Let's not turn him into kindling. Stand back. I will breach the perimeter. It's too thick. It's too thick. Who knew? That's it. Just like the Arago drop, bud. On three, two... Oh, that dashed witch stripped you down to your bark. You know, we'd have showed up sooner, but I uh, told the toast. Good to have you back, Root. Now all we need is an exit. Um... I guess Groot knows the way. Hey, wait up, bud. What's going on? Say something. You okay, Groot? Shut it, Quill. What did I do? You're the one who insisted on this stupid plan. Now that freaking monster queen has... I don't know. <laughs> traumatized him. Oops, sorry. Exactly. Is that it, big guy? Are you hurt? Perhaps the tree has been bewitched. She did do something to that Tartar. So no one's gonna talk about the fact that he's walking around naked. Oh, shut the floor, traps. Let me think. Jeez, what sort of creature is bad enough that even Hellbender keeps it in the cage? Nope. Nope, don't do spiders, snakes, or weird tentacle things. We should let all these things loose. It doesn't seem so bad. They're like pets. Like pets. Spoken by a woman who ain't spent enough time in a cage. Not all cages have bars. Just... yuck. I am familiar with some of these creatures. They're not as rare as I would have expected for Lady Hellbender's collection. Never meet your heroes, Drax. Oh, 
Doing this again, huh? I was expecting more creatures than this. Did you not see the skylight? It looks like there's tons more floors like this below us. What is that smell? It's the mulcha. The what? The dry grass. Or at least it's supposed to be dry. Yeah, maybe don't leave it out when you've got a hole in your ceiling. It's like the Flarkin Collector's Museum all over again. At least these beasts seem... I don't know what happened to the game. Why it keeps freezing in that one spot. I'll try loading it again. I had almost the same thing happen in uh, Atomic Heart. I was trying to play that yesterday. And it kept crashing in the same part. Over and over. Well, let's see if this will load again. Easy there, bud. I'll get you out in a flash. Whoa! Hey, let's not turn him into kindling. Stand back. I will breach the perimeter. It's too thick. It's too thick. Who knew? That's it. Just like the Arago drop, bud. On three, two... Ah, oh, that dashed witch stripped you down to your bark. You know, we'd have showed up sooner, but I twinkled the toes. Good to have you back, Root. Now all we need is an exit. Um, I guess Groot knows the way. Hey, wait up, bud. What's going on? Say something. You okay, Groot? Shut it, Quill. What did I do? You're the one who insisted on this stupid plan. Now that freaking monster queen has... I don't know. Traumatized him.
Exactly. Is that it, big guy? Are you hurt? Perhaps the tree has been bewitched. She did do something to that Tarotar. So no one's gonna talk about the fact that he's walking around naked. You all shut your flark and traps and let me think? Hey, come on, talk to me, bud. What did that Badoon Flarker do to you? There we go. Oh, crap. Guardians of the galaxy. You fools thought you could cheat me and suffer no consequence. Groot. Which one of you thought it wise to entrust your absurd scheme to a Flora Colossus? You call him friend, yet you ignore his very nature, overlooking the fact that he is... The worst liar in history. I told you, he can't just pretend to be monstrous. To his credit, he kept your secret for almost an hour. Lady Hellbender, let us settle this honorably. I will face you in combat. Honorably? Your offer is worthless, Destroyer. There is no escaping my wrath! I can work with that. Dweller, feast upon them! Get them! Who's that 
deal with the Tremendi shark on the inside. Rush them! Destroy oh, them! Guy. Guy. Escaping Lady Hellbender's wrath. We'll see about that. What the?
will hunt us to the end of the universe. Who gives us Scud? We got off that mud ball with the money, didn't we? Only after the talking tree betrayed us. I am Groot. I do not speak tree. Tree. Hey, you got a problem with Groot. You got a problem with me. Whoa, 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 whoa. One problem at a time. Lady Hellbender will seek her revenge. Mark my words. Then she'll have to get in line. First, I gotta call Corel. The sooner we get this fine paid, the better. Yeah, so we can go back to focusing on being broke. That's weird. Is money all that you think of, Rodent? No, I also think about bombs. And booze. <gasps> bombs made out of booze. Nikki! Is it true? I really want to There's something wrong with the connection. Did you twist the thingy? Yeah, no dice. Nikki, is your mom around? I really need to talk to her. She's with me. Inside me. After you left, we went to the quarantine zone. I sunk aboard and there was dark fog. Did you try narrowing the band? First thing I tried, it's gotta be something else. I'm losing you, Nick. Can you put your mom on? I knew you were my dad. I think something has happened to the girl. Yeah, it's called she's Novacor. Can you fix it? <sighs> yeah, yeah, right. keep your star pants on. Right. I'll go check the array. Bring her back. Give me the wall back. I just have to... Confiscated a llama thingy. A llama. What did I say? Who gives a flying scut? The gold domes didn't get rid of it, and now the array's fucked. I promise we'll get it fixed soon. Yeah, just like you promised to get your girlfriend to go easy on us. Yeah. Okay. Hey, that's not fair. You know what isn't fair, Quill? Being the only one who actually seems to give a scut about the Milano. Look, guys. We need the dock to fix the array. Luckily, I know a guy I'm nowhere has got the parts we need. And he can get rid of that Nova Trek cheap. No, we cannot abandon the child. Her behavior was erratic. The llama thing you chewed the wires, Drax. It was probably just a bad connection. And if we remove the tracker, Corel will make sure the entire Nova Corps fleet is on alert for us. Gamora's right. We made a promise. I made a promise. See if you can pinpoint where Corel is. We pay the fine. Quill, are you freaking kidding me? That way, we don't have to keep looking over our shoulders for Nova on the next job. If there is a next job. <sighs> Sounds like Groot's got that toothy bastard under control. Better not come back here and try to finish chewing through my ship! Or else! Must be the assassin. What did I do again? The refrigerator door was left open. Yeah, Gamora. Or was it the abomination? Yeah, Rocket. Uh, penny for your thoughts? What is a penny? Uh, it's money. Like units. The saying means I pay to know what you're thinking. We must use our currency to pay the Nova Corps fine, or we risk... Drax... Just tell me what's up. I am realizing that I do not know as much as I thought I did. Our visit to Seknarf-9 was not what I expected. Because Lady Hellbender isn't a giant? She is definitely not. That is only part of it, Peter Quill. On our way to her fortress, I realize that many of my assumptions about this team have been incorrect as well. Really? The assassin and the rodent. Without them and the tree fighting nobly beside us, we would not be alive right now. I told you, they're not bad people just because they have a bad past. Life is... complicated, Drax. Things are never simple. On Katath, it was. I had a family that I cherished and a certainty about life. 
that I no longer possess. I'm sure you'll find it again. Just give it some time. Anyone in there? Rocket? What? Can't you see I'm busy? Is that my toothbrush? It fits in the uh, small cracks. Oh, Rocket, please! Hold it in for a tick. I'm almost done. You are right to be worried about the broken communications array, Rodent. A potential client might contact us and find our messaging system unavailable. Our inbox has been dry for cycles, Drax. I'm good. Oh, nice! You made a cute little pen. You didn't mean to chew up the comms, did you? <laughs> Looks sturdy enough. You sure it'll be okay in there? I'm good. Rodent, will you have time to repair the broken refrigerator door? What? Like now? In the near future. I got a whole comms array to fix. And then I'm getting started on some weapons upgrades for the ship. I ain't got time for no fridge door. We could be halfway to nowhere by now. And only a few rotations away from getting that Flark and Nova Tracker off. Better much? Yeah, I am. Going to nowhere without paying our fine would bring more trouble in the long run. Gamora, did you find... <gasps> Are those dolls? Yes. No. It doesn't matter. The Halos Hope's in the Teo system. Coordinates are in your console. So... Why'd you close the view screen? None of your business. Isn't it, though? Sounds like you're trying to hide something from us. Yes, I am. Hate to disappoint, but I saw everything. Didn't really peg you as a doll collector. And yes, I value my life. Peter, I'm not gonna kill you for asking about my collection. That's good, because last time... So what if I collect them? A lot of people have hobbies. Groot collects plants. Rocket's obsessed with bombs. Yeah, yeah, and Drax has a lot of really scary looking knives. See? Nothing out of the ordinary. I guess. You know, as a kid, I collected stuff too. Baseball cards, action figures. You think collections are childish? No, 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 uh, that's not what I meant. <laughs> I'm messing with you, Peter. I don't care what you think. I'd just rather keep my hobbies to myself. Time's ticking away, Peter. Okay, Corel. Corel is get probably ready monitoring the ship, waiting to see if we make the right choice. Looks like your girlfriend held up her end of the bargain, Quill. We know for sure it's her. Checking. Same designation as before. It's definitely Halas Hope. Ship's fine. Which part? Ask Quill. He's the one who keeps crashing. All right, let's pay that fine. So, what?
What should we do with the leftover money after we pay off the cops? I say we get a landing assist program. There won't be much left, but we should use it to get intel on our next contract. What are the odds they arrest us as soon as we step outside? Depends. How many outstanding warrants do you have? A couple. My record is clean. We should jettison that thing. It's all yours. And it's done. I've made it foolproof, just for you. Rock, it'll come around. Just try not to eat anything else, okay? Ready to pay our fine? Hi, Groot. Even Groot can see you're here for some blueberry pie. I'm going on the record that I don't want to be here, and that being here is a mistake. You ever been to the Rock before? Yeah, looks like every other Novacore station. This reminds me of when I surrendered to the authorities. What was it like? Liberating. Okay, here we go. If they so much as scratched her paints, we get Novacore to reduce our fine. Good luck with that. It's gross negligence. Negligence. That's what I said. Where is everybody? Most Nova stations are heavily automated, all synchronized by the world mind. It is unsettling. Not like they had much choice after the war. Too many seats, not enough butts. Seems more efficient this way, anyway. Sure. Till the world mind sneezes and suddenly you got no life support. That is a precarious system. It doesn't work that way. He's exaggerating. M ship. Designation Milano. Move whoa, to holding whoa, space. Whoa. R seven Get back here with my ship. PL. Present validated ticket to kiosk prior to departure. Ticket? How the fuck are we supposed to get off this rock? Just moving it. Let's just focus on the fine. They need to remove that tracker thing anyway. If there's one scratch, I'll... If there's any scratches, I'll buff them out myself. That I gotta see. Larkin knew I should have stayed on board. Coming, Rocket? Yeah, yeah. How should I know? Ask the former Nova cop. Ask me what? And I wasn't actually part of Nova Corps. Groot wants to know how come there's no patrol ships. The Rock isn't really that kind of station. Okay, it's not supposed to be this empty. Is it a holiday? Space cops don't take holidays. Hello? <laughs> We're here to pay a fine. Looking for Centurion Corral? Doors locked. Well, we tried. Come on, let's go. We're not leaving. We'll go to them if we have to. Look, the door controls are on the other side if we can get you there. So what? Now I'm supposed to hack Novacore security? I mean, if you don't think you can. Cheap shot, Quill. We are discussing breaking into a Novacore facility. Any chance they're all just on break? 
I am Groot. Groot says the kiosk still says open. I say it ain't our problem. Odd. What is? I mean, besides all of this. There's nothing. Not even a welcome screen. It is on, right? They're always on. Constant connection to the world mind. That's the point. This one's been severed. Huh. Ain't this the way? Never a space cop when you need one. I'd settle for a desk clerk. I'd settle for us leaving a note and getting the flark off this rock. We are meant to be clearing our fine, not adding to it. All right, there's an air duct in here. Could be a way in, Rocket. Could, sure. Or maybe it drops down into the hangar. Think you can squeeze through this vent? If you can get it open, I ain't that flexible. Come on, Drax. Impossible. Groot, time to shine. Don't ask him to do weird stuff. Mora, you do it. Not me. Hey, Drax, get me a can of Power Star, would you? The machine is inoperable, and I am not in the habit of lending units. I never said I'd pay you back. supposed to be leaving thirsty big guy this machine appears to be inoperable maybe they're just all out of your flavor perhaps this is a test See if we will respect the bureaucratic process. Well, newsflash, I don't. And if they want their money, they better hurry up and come and take it. You gold domes hear me? There, one open air duct. Oh, now was, we have damaged Nova Corps property. Eh, just a little. All right, Rocket, see if this vent leads into that other room. And be careful. You know, I still don't love this whole pay or fine plan, but I gotta say, Messing with some Nova Corps tech ain't a bad consolation prize. Huh. There's something screwy with the power grid. It's like we're on backup only. I'm passing you through. You know the drill. Tell me which circuits to switch. We can only rerun power to so many things at once. On it! Flarkin' right at Hey, I think I can set off the sprinklers from this thing. Does that help? Only if you want to get wet. Yeah, good point. Prepare to be amazed. Guys? Oh, ho, ho. Clever. But I'll bet you didn't think of this. We'll find hey, that sort of worked. Presto! What else? You know, ta-da! That is no more clear. It is conspicuously silent. Good point. Hey, Nova, we want to pay our fine and get your Katrakan tracker off my ship. Hello? 
Anybody? Come take our money, you gold dome pencil pushers! I objected to our unlawful entry. This isn't oh. helping! Says you. I heard someone. Oh, poor little guy. It is a thing. Your sympathies are redundant. Hey, I'm half someone out there. Remember? I did not. There! You hear that? Uh, hey there. You want to know What gave it away? Whoever y'all are, come here a minute. Hey, jumpsuit. You gotta get me out of here. I don't belong in the cage. Novacorp begs to differ. Well, no one asked you, scary eyes. We should not be aiding and abetting a criminal. Weren't you a Novacorp prisoner? Indeed, and I served my time. What are you in for? What? Nothing. Case of mistaken identity. They mistook me for someone who gave a crap. Ooh, I like him. I'm back at you, weasel. So how about helping a guy out? See if there's a door release or something. I know these cells open. This can possibly... Hey, what did you do? Uh... Hey, where am I going? What's happening? Wonder where it took him. Furnace. Congrats, Quill. You just executed your first prisoner. That seems improbable. That big haunted house on Dervani was spooky. You! Hey, buddy! Ah! Uh, oh, hey! Oh, what now? I got rights! Now this place brings back memories. What are you doing? I figured as long as we're here, I may as well try and dig up some juicy Nova secrets. Maybe they even got a bead on Gamora's blue or half. Not likely. What's that? Nothing. I formally declare my objection to trespassing in a Nova Corps facility. Noted. See? Drax doesn't want to pay the fine either. That is not what I said. You are conflating my meaning. Hey, I'm with you, big guy. I say we get the flock out of here. I'm getting a real haunted mansion vibe from this place. And none of that screams run away to you? Ugh, elevator's out. But the shaft above looks open. We can use it to climb up there. You expect us to walk on that thing? It'll hold more than the five of us. Please don't fall, please don't fall. Okay, piece of cake. <laughs> Ooh, spooky. Hello. to a puddle of goo. Each one is gene-coded by the world mind. Are you saying the world mind has the genetic code of every... Ah, no wonder the doors are open. All right, let's hope that holds. What do you think one of these suits would go for on the black market? Don't even think about it. How come this one gets its own room? Looks like a workshop. You know, I hear they anodize these things with some kind of Zendarian smart metal. Metal cannot be smart. Smarter than some. What'll it be this time? Confetti jet boats? Some quality crafting, if I might say so myself. More 
nothing. There's gotta be an explanation. The House Hope is a capital ship. Maybe they're all there for some reason. Or maybe this whole place is contaminated with Bormerian pox. I am experiencing a mild itching sensation. Yeah, and I got a real pain in my ass. Rocket, do your magic. No. What? I said no. When are you gonna come to your senses, Quill? I am cold. And then what? He's gonna drag us halfway through this station if we let him. Okay, we try one more room, and if we still haven't found anything, we leave. Deal? Fine. One more room, not two. One. Flarked. We ain't going back that way. I thought the Nova Corps had more ships. I heard they got uh, staffing issues. From who? People. In places with uh, other people. Peter Quill. I found this. Sector 1. Check in. Sector 1 sweep complete. 75% acceptance rate. It is as she promised. Have faith. Promise will be made real. Proceed to Sector 7. With faith. Well, the good news is we're not alone. There's lots of chatter. Tell them I want my ship back. My ship. I sense there's a butt. But it sounds like they're searching for something or someone. Could explain why no one's around. Well, who gives a flark? Tell them to get their golden butts up here. The promise will be made real. Proceed to Sector 7. Uh, hey there. Is this thing on? We're, uh, we're looking for Centurion Corral. Who is we? We're the Guardians of the Galaxy. We were supposed to meet Centurion Corral to pay a fine. Hello, Guardians of the Galaxy. I would be more than happy to assist you today. Where are you now? We're, uh, in some sort of monitoring station. Understood. Stay where you are. We will come to you. Well, what did they say? They're coming to us. Huh. It's about Flark and time. Where's Centurion Corral? Have faith. She is not with us at this time. Have faith? Really? Anyone else seeing a purple glow around these guys? I do not trust them. There's an alternative plan, now may be the time to execute it. I am Groot. Come. All will be made clear. What do you mean there's no Centurion Corral? Her ship's literally docked outside. I understand your confusion. We will set your tumultuous souls at ease. Come, Guardians of the Galaxy. We will take you to the Hallow's Hope. Then you too can have faith. Cool, cool, cool. Um, and that all sounds super great. It's just, sorry, what's your name again? You may refer to me as Carlos. Right, right, Carlos. Listen, we really need to pay our fine. Uh, then we can go on our way, you can go on your creepy Temple of Doom way. It's a win-win for everyone. Perhaps. Have you embraced her divine promise? Hmm. Only if I get her consent first. For the promise to be made real. All living beings must accept it completely. Come, have faith. Your quail, we cannot return the way we came. All right, change of plans. Let's take these freaks to church. Purge the dark of the earth! Someone's getting purged!
This will not reflect well on our find. I don't think that matters now. With that door, Clark, we gotta go out the way they came in. So expect more of them purple freaks. Yeah, what was with that weird glow they had? Let's just find Corral. I'm sure she'll know what's going on. Yeah, if she don't try and kill us like the last lot. No way. Not Corral. Oh, well, that's just great. Let's just find Corral. I'm sure she'll know what's going on. Yeah, if you don't try and kill us like the last one. No way. Not Corral. Standoff. Not good. Clark, Nova killing Nova. Which side won? Wow. There's your answer. Oh, man. This is bad. I will not stand here and wait to die. None of us got a whole lot of... Boys! Oh! Clark and Meathead, nice knowing you! Peter! Everyone's gone nuts. Oh! Bend your knees when you land! Can you handle that many? Not much we can do about it now. Fear me! We are more than capable of vanquishing these traitors! Throw that, Drax! The others should be on their way! Big guy, 12 o'clock! Current time is irrelevant. Bear, How are kill has arrived! Ah, that is much more informative! Those who resist must be burned! You said it, buddy! They dishonor the principles of law enforcement! Imagine what the world mind would think! These bombs are making things way too crowded! I say time for a little crowd control! Take them out! Underutilized! Dead! Like, really? When possible, circle 
Run! Electrical hazards! I think our fine will be paid today. You don't say. Guys, Quill's ship is right there. We just need to... What? What do we need to do, Quill? A whole bunch of whacked out space cops just tried to vaporize us. And you want to go looking for a rematch? Because your, your girlfriend might be in trouble? That's not what I'm doing, and she's not my girlfriend. Could have fooled me. Rocket! The only thing that this is about is getting our ship back. We find Corel, and then none of this is our problem anymore. You're right. It won't be our problem anymore. Because we didn't sign up to be run around halfway across the galaxy by a, a cop loving human! Come on. Seriously, Corel? Join the Guardian, she said. It'll be good for your mental health, she said. <sighs> All right. Listen to Flark up. Groot and I are getting off this dast rock. Anyone who'd like a ride can follow us. Everyone else can go to hell. I prefer the rodent's plan. It's a tribe. Sweep Sector 7. The intruders must be found. I knew this was a bad idea. Saw it coming a parsec away. You foresaw a mutiny of the entire station. Rocket, come on! You come on! I told you we should have left! And we are! I'm on board! Let's find the Milano the and- Intruders reported in the repair bay! And try not to die in the process! First sensible thing you said, all cycle! Intruders in C Junction! <laughs> Oh, 
Let's not wait around. Jeez. Hey, you said we needed to go up, right? More up than this. Never thought I'd be fighting Novacor again. They are no longer Novacor. Yeah, this don't count. But who or what are they? What's with that glowing? For once, let's keep our noses out of it. took her ship back to Xandar to report. Look, are they praying? What the hell have we wandered into? Check out that big guy. Don't look like no Nova to me. He's a sorcerer. Behold the magic flow to the altar. There's no such thing as magic, right? Come on, let's get moving before these whack drops spot us. It's like we stumbled on some creepy cult. I told you, it ain't our problem. It will be if they've taken over Nova Corps. No Nova, no find, no problem. We should probably tell someone. Yeah, tell it to your diary. Come on, down here. How do you know? I don't. I'm just putting distance between us and those whack jobs. Nice to see you listening for a change. You cannot see listening. I'll be right back.
All right, sorry about that. If anybody's watching now or in the future, I'm sorry. I had to go make myself a coffee, even though it's 2.14 in the afternoon. Don't you start with me, Muscles. You're still mostly in my good books. Who says I can't? This is his fault. In fact, I'm done talking to him. To who? You! Too late. Huh? Groot, tell Mr. One More Room him and me are done. Fine. Quill, Groot says you and me are done. This is not productive to our egress from this station. All you, Drax. Absolutely not. We should keep moving. Well, another glitch where it doesn't let me pick anybody but Drax. Well, let's try loading the checkpoint again. I swear this thing didn't have that many problems the first time. Probably I tell played someone. It. Yeah, tell it to your diary. Come on, down here. How do you know? I don't. I'm just putting distance between us and those whack jobs. Nice to see you listening for a change. You cannot see listening. Don't you start with me, muscles. You're still mostly in my good books. I am good. Who says I can't? This is his fault. In fact, I'm done. So, you think? Yeah, I'll deal with the door. Whoa! Purge the faceless, Marcus! Send it their way, Drax! You think they saw us spying on them? What's it matter? They're here now! Sick of I will end you! Ready! Oh, 
Guessing of just sure. These doors have been barricaded. Means someone at least tried to resist. Bad lot of good it did them. We don't know that. There could still be others on the station. Or maybe those were the survivors who fled on the Hallows Hope. Were we in the same elevator? Those Nova barely got a shot off before they were gunned down by them glowy ones. Uh is that? Let's just pretend we didn't see that. So let's flark and go already. Hang here we come. What the flark was that docking number? R73-4PO. Are you serious? Always. You're my new favorite person, Muscles. <laughs> no, not really. There she is. Come to Papa. 4PL. Done. All right. Bay is clear. Extending catwalks. And... Flark! What's up? The clamps won't release. Those whack jobs must have triggered a lockdown. Can you override it? Wouldn't be much of a lockdown if I could. I can hold her in position and get the engines warmed up. But you're gonna have to release those clamps manually. All right, release the clamps and don't die. All faithful, converge on the central hangar. None can He's escape wrapping. her life. Clamps, Peter! We'll try to keep them off you! Down. I think these guys would mind getting out of the way. Feel free to ask them. Try to keep them from swarming. I thought that was your job. Ramora, what a fool! Open the Nova Corps track clock! These renegades are relentless! Hey, Rocket! You get us the twos for the Milano! Play like the Tapian Sea Song! Trap! Try to keep them off, Peter! It's good! I'm good! Bye-bye, Nova Corner! Way to knock some sense into him! What's next, 
We should set course for Contraxia. They bear our issues over a cold I don't hate it, but... We should report what we saw first, right? Because that's our biggest problem, Quill. Come on, Groot, we got Scott to do. Rocket! What's with him? The abomination is never happy. Rocket's got a point, though. Our comms are flarked, the tracker's still counting down, and Corel could be anywhere in the universe. <sighs> it's not looking good. We are in the place between hard rocks. You mean a rock and a hard place? That is what I said. Helen knows we could use a night off. So, Contraxia? We should go to nowhere instead. Ah, another suitable location to partake in liberal libations. To report what we saw. Me and Cosmo go way back. He's chief of security. He'll make sure the right people know about the rock. And the tracker and fine? Rocket's got a guy in nowhere. We kill two birds with one stone. Okay. I'll set the coordinates. Maybe... talk to Rocket?
Peter Quill, what does killing two birds with one stone signify? It means solving two problems with a single solution. Ha! I knew it! There are no birds on nowhere. Depends if she are count. Saw a few of them last time. Maybe we should check other Novacore stations to see if they're all right. You want to check out Novacore, you do it after we get to nowhere. We should avoid making the rodent angrier. Uh, I'm sorry, Drax. I thought paying her fine would make things better, but it just made things more complicated. Do not apologize, Peter Quill. Our encounter with Novacore has given me clarity of purpose. We must investigate and fight whoa, this- Whoa, whoa there, Drax. We ain't fighting Novacore if we can help it. We'll just let Cosmo handle this. The soldiers we encountered were not acting like Novacore officers. And those robed priests, it was all very disturbing. Do you ever ponder how different your lives would have been had you joined the Nova Corps? You asking me or Peter? Both. I don't think either of us would have fared very well. You are not fond of peacekeeping. And Peter's not fond of helmets. It messes with his hair. Assassin. Will really cared. Hey, uh, guys? What's up? Nothing at all, Quill. Not a thing. Uh, something wrong with Groot? Nope. He's just, uh, defoliating. Seasonal thing. Come on, I know you're lying. You guys are planning something. What we do ain't none of your business. Can't we just talk about it? Talking ain't worth scut if you don't put your money where your mouth is. Things are gonna get better, I promise. We'll fix it. Just like you promised before Seknarf? Leave us alone, Quill. Uh, Rocket? Flark off, Quill! I need to clear my mind. This book is not helping. If you need a recommendation, I just finished the World Mind's postmortem on ineffective planetary scale battle tactics of the Galactic War. What part of this would help clear my mind? None. It's very upsetting to read. I guess it has to be done, because you're flarked without me. Remember that. I'd rather be anywhere else. Get out of my room, Quill. What are you doing here? Leave! Come on, guys. Groot says, go away. Ah, uh, Groot. Why? So those coordinates... They're in your console. Got it. Nowhere, here we come. home to the best black market deals you can find. And surprisingly good noodles. You ever wondered what kind of person found it was like, Oh look! The severed head of a giant celestial being. Let's drill holes in it and live inside. They wanted the brain tissue. 
Very rare, very valuable. The marketplace came after, along with noobs. You are certain this Cosmo is trustworthy, Peter Quill? Of course, he's chief of security. <laughs> and nowhere. And as such, probably deals in Novacore all the time. Trust me, he's gonna want to know about the rock. What are they doing back there? Shenanigans, likely. See you never, flark bags! A rocket and Groot, did they really leave? Yes. It looks like it. I am Do certain we know you where they went. Without the help You're the last assistance. one who talked to them. Yeah, Rocket seemed pissed off. Try to behave while we're gone, okay? Maybe when we get back, I'll ask Groot to give you a bath. Guess you were right. Turns out we couldn't trust those guys. I still have faith that the tree will bring the rodent to reason. At least you're still here. I wouldn't want to miss your meeting with Cosmo. Fine, whatever. We'll talk to Cosmo and then we'll go out and have a good time. Like I said, we go way back. Plus, he's probably already heard about what's happening. All we do is confirm the rumor. Maybe he'll even give us a reward. Didn't think I'd miss nowhere this much. The attachment we feel to certain places and people are sometimes unexplainable. That's surprisingly profound, Drax. Told you to move these containers. We've got another shipment coming in. One of them is leaking. What about Rocket and Groot? What about them? They vacation. left. What am I supposed to do? Chase them down and beg them to come back? You could apologize. That's your advice? The apology does not need to be sincere. Then what's the point? I guess if we ever see him again. Big if, by the way. But if it happens, then maybe I might think about it. Anyway. Once we let Cosmo know what's happening out there, we'll have more time to think about what to do with Rocket. If Rocket doesn't come back, we'll need a contingency plan for getting rid of the Nova Tracker. Why? We have not yet spent our ill-gotten gains. We could still pay the fine. But we'd have to go all the way to New Xandar to do it. What if we get there and it's compromised too? How do we find this Cosmo? We head to his tower on the far side of the market. That's where he keeps an eye on things. Cosmo again. I guess I kind of miss the old boy. How exactly do you know him? Was he also a prisoner of the Chitauri? Nope, we met right here, back when I was in the Ravagers. Dishonorable killers and thieves. The Ravagers actually did some good during the war. Even the mangiest of mutts will behave, and it befits them. Whatever bad stuff we all did is behind us. We're the good guys now. Right, heroes for hire. Except no one will hire us. Maybe Cosmo will have a fetch quest for us or something. We might even come out ahead on this. Keep an eye on your things. These kooks are a bit hands-on, if you know what I mean. They have fortune tellers on Earth, Peter Quill. There are people who claim to be able to see the future, sure. 
The soothsayers on Katath were unable to predict its demise. No one could predict what Thanos would do. The Mad Titan will pay for everything that he has destroyed. He's gone, Drax. His death helped end the war. Come on! Who are his adopted dog? <laughs> Nexus, what are you? Do you still have those suicidal urges? What? No? Huh. And you thought joining a team would be bad for you. Hi. Sunlord, right? Is it Rockstar? It's Star Lord. Hey, that's right. I forget which version of you I've met. Did you do the thing yet? What is the thing she is referring to? No idea. Hi. I don't know if we've met yet. I'm... No. No, no, no. It's not... Oh. Oh, he... oh. No, he's lying! I mean... Oh. By the Kotatis he wrote, the broken promise of all will be mended. Less depressed. Thanks. Don't worry. It's always weird the first time. Celestial Madonna! Ah. Uh, Hi, guys. You should not be in this place. Actually, I'm exactly where I need to be. <laughs> I think. No. Yes, this is where I need to be. Or needed to be. Am needed, yes. Wait, why are you here? You cannot keep leaving the sanctuary. It's not safe. There are rumblings in the galaxy. <laughs> when aren't there rumblings in the galaxy? <laughs> yeah, okay. You're gonna keep making that face. It was nice seeing you again, Gamora. Star guy. Green moon. Okay, bye. So, Gamora, you and Mantis seem close. We've met. Okay. You're being evasive, woman. Wait, woman? That's the nicest thing you've ever called me. I'm not gonna ask, but if you wanted to talk about it... We met after I escaped from a failed job. I, I was in bad shape. I'd probably be dead if Mantis hadn't found me. She saved your life. Yep, end of story. That is not the end of the story. I know, big guy. Let's just not push it right now. You seem to know the insect woman, Peter Quill, even if she could not remember your name. Last time I saw her was... <clears throat> I need to leave. Uh, something wrong? It's not your business, Peter Quill. Do not wait for me. Drax! Watch it, Star Lord! Watch yourself, jerky red guy! Can you believe that? Uh. Gamora? Let's go talk to Cosmo alone. Up the Milano, give the team a huge bonus. Are you ready to buy the jackpot of a lifetime? How will I know if I win? You are encouraged to return to nowhere to verify your ticket. After verification, 
And in excess of the reputation feed, the jackpot will be transferred to your account. I'll take one. Here you are. No fortune to smile on you. More than she smiles on me. All right. Guess I'll be seeing you in a few rotations. With any luck, sir. With any luck. Good for you. Bad for me. Lottery tickets. Lottery tickets. on the grill, local stuff and exotic meals from as far away as Mac Newport. I hope Cosmo's in the office. Bridge closed. Go away. Doesn't look closed. Sisu. Nowhere security. Super official. Go out the way. Ali. Ali. I really need to see Cosmo. Cosmo not in tower. He out there, Star Lord in Ali. Wait. How did you know my name? Go. Or end up in Cosmo prison. You choose.
actually a pretty good song. I'm surprised that I'm allowed to play that while in stream mode. somewhere in this maze of rotting brain matter. Okay, just gotta find Cosmo, then I can deal with the team, if I can find them. Are you afraid, Peter Quill? I'm a brute and near invincible. I fear nothing. You, however, will perish in this maze. Who's there? Oh, I hate mazes. Especially stinking brain mazes. Okay, dude. Deep breath. Deep breath. Breath. Look at you, Flarkin Humey. Bet you end up inside one of them processing machines. Flark! I give myself a heart attack. Got here. Watch it, Star Lord. And what's a filthy scut stained Terran doing out here, Rawson? Hiding's what I think, Garrick. Aye. Terrans always be hiding. Cause everybody knows Terrans are scrawny. And good for eating. Uh, if you're into that, we might be into that. Except for the bounty. Hey, guys. Wouldn't happen to know where Cosmo's office is, would you? I get the distinct feeling that you're looking for someone of the Earth persuasion. <laughs> I get it, man. I get it. Us Earthers, we all look the same. It's not like you guys who very clearly look different. Get to the point, Darren. The point is, is I can help you find who you're actually looking for. Terrans do all look the same. Except this Terran's got a word on his back. Just like the bounty says. What's that word on your back say? Oops. Sorry, I'm getting a phone. Sorry, I'm getting a phone call.
well, this is going to have to be the end of session one. Uh, I might come back a little later. I know there's probably not really anybody watching this, but it is what it is. To be continued.